be sure to pick up your complimentary gift bag on your way out the door. Ninja. Arigato. Teen Warrior. Somebody. Arigato. 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 Hey guys, what's going on? It's DJ here with my brothers, Jeremy and Bears. Yeah, Bears is here. Yeah. Hi. Woo. Bringing you this week's episode of the Flash Weekly Recap. Anyways, tonight's episode is called Running to Stand Still. Play the clip. Zoom makes his way back to Earth-1 and chases after Wells. He's able to stop him from using a speed damping serum the second time around. He tells Wells that he is giving him a certain amount of time before he kills his daughter to do his bidding for him. Then he vanishes. Mark Martin breaks James Jesse and Leonard Snart out of Iron Heights in an effort to team up to kill the Flash. Snart declines and warns Barry as repayment for him saving Snart's sister. Before this, Patty and Barry make out so awesome. Then Iris walks in and tells him about her brother Wally. She finds comfort in Barry and they watch as it snows and then he tells her that they're going to tell Joe together. When Patty learns that Martin is back in the city, she sets out for revenge against him for killing her father years earlier. Jesse and Martin place bombs hidden in Christmas griffs, griffs? <laughs> hidden in Christmas gifts around the city, threatening to set them off in families' homes if Barry does not sacrifice himself. Wells, Sisko, and Garrick find one of the bombs and send it through one of the dimensional breaches. The trio alters the magnetic polarity of the bomb to force it to attract the rest, removing them from the city. With the bombs gone, Barry subdues Martin and Jesse. Patty arrives, ready to kill Martin, but Barry talks her out of it. Meanwhile, Barry and Joe have a heart-to-heart -heart and everybody decides to go to the West household for Christmas. Barry, using Earth 2 Wells as a stand-in, tells Eobard that he forgives him, and then he invites Earth 2 Wells to go to the Christmas party with them. Everybody's there and is fine and dandy. Joe and Iris, Caitlin and Jay, Barry and Patty, Cisco, and in walks in Wally West. This episode was amazing. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Jiggle wiggle diggle. <laughs> Wells decides to spend his Christmas with Zoom. Zoom reveals Wells' daughter and shows that she is still safe, but then takes her back. He gives Wells an ultimatum and says to help him steal Barry's speed, fattening him up like a turkey and taking him out. Mid-season finale of The Flash. Running to stand still. Crypto. Boo. All right. So, man, this was uh, is pretty good season finale. I, I got to say right off the bat. What do you guys mid think? Mid-season finale. Mid-season, yes. Mid-season. So it was a very good mid-season finale. So much hype, man. One sentence. Uh, Merry Christmas. Yeah. yeah. So... We get the episode opening up with Wells is running down the hallway, and I totally thought like this was some sort of flashback thing happening, but he is in the current Star Labs, and Zoom is chasing after his ass, yeah. and he tries to shoot him with the speed dampening thing. Is that what it was? Sure, or? let's go with that. All right, so he tries to, nope, fails, and Zoom gets him, and he is basically forcing him. Blackmail. Yeah. 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 Extortion. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. To do his bidding for him because he has his daughter obviously and he's like i need you to do stuff i asked you to do mm -hmm. and wells is like okay fine just don't hurt my daughter then and he's just like merry christmas ninja. oh yeah yeah i missed that yeah he did say that so we get back to jitters and iris is there with her dad she shows her the flash toy i, I don't know did she get that for barry maybe that's her lame excuse for a present yeah for barry because she can't think of nothing <laughs> so she is still keeping the secret of francine having another kid and then they have this talk about the watch that Joe had and how it belonged to his father or grandfather? I think grandfather. His grandfather. And it doesn't work, but he's kept it because like, I guess, you know, sentimental. So, yeah. after that we get to the scene where, I don't know why, but, uh, dad was like looking over my shoulder and he was just like, of course you're watching something like that. Uh, Barry and Patty <laughs> are, you know, getting it on wow. halfway yeah, through Toothbrush. Yeah, perfect exactly. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Toothbrush Barry action going on, or half Toothbrush Barry, and then Iris walks in, yeah. and she leaves. Not as cringeworthy as uh, Wynn walking no, in on yeah. uh, Supergirl and Jimmy, but yeah, going back to the flesh. Yeah, so Patty leaves, and then Iris, you know, finds comfort in Barry, and yes. saying like, oh, now I know what it feels like to keep a secret, or for you having kept the flash from me, Yeah, I had to keep the secret about my brother, and it's crushing her that she hasn't been able to tell Joe, so Barry's like, it's 
okay. We could tell him together because he's awesome. I come very handled, Dad. He's very mature. Like in just the past year, he he's dealt with his arch nemesis, new one, Zoom. He broke his back, putting people away in Iron Heights. It's just intense. He's matured a lot. So that, that, like Iris just comes up to him, he's like, "I got this secret. I don't know what to do with it." And Barry's just like, "Back it. Let's go tell him." <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so back at Star Labs, Jay and Caitlin are talking about science stuff. I wasn't exactly sure what they're talking about, but Cisco walks in and is like, you guys just gotta just make out already. Like, the thirst is real between you two. Just just do it. <laughs> Not <laughs> bad like, for a dude that just broke up with his girlfriend there. I know. Yeah. After that, Wells walks in, and he's just... He said the same thing twice throughout this episode. Someone's like, are you okay? And he's like, yeah, why wouldn't I be? It just didn't look right, so... Something sketchy about him. Yeah, super sketchy. Then, at Iron Heights, Mark Martin busts through the door and breaks... Oh, other well, wizard! Yes. <laughs> yeah! Busts through the door. He's the reason for all the snow happening. Barry should have noticed that, I guess. All of a sudden, a blizzard happens. I wouldn't question it. It's a Christmas He let him miracle. go. <laughs> it's a Christmas. So he busts through... Breaks out uh, Captain Cold and Crazy Trickster. And uh, it's always nice to see Mark Hamill back. And he has a proposition for them. I want us three to work together to bring out the Flash and then kill him. Snart wasn't really on board at all, actually. He's a well, changing yeah, man. Snart, not even that. Like, Snart and Barry have, like, their own agreement, right? Don't yeah. kill anybody. I'll let you do your own thing. So why would you want to screw that up? That's true. That's true. Now, with them being on the loose, Patty, or her father, was killed by the Martin brothers, right? She finds out that he's out there and she wants to kill him for what he did. And Barry just, he's not able to convince her, I guess. And would you be like how she was acting this episode? She wants Damn to right, peel that dude's wig back, yo. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, Barry is unable to convince her not to do anything stupid. So what are we gonna call this little group? Half of the half of the injustice. The rogues gallery. Oh, rogues. Okay, so half what? of the rogues, right? They the trickster, snart, and yeah, weather. Yeah, that's half the rogues, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So half of the rogues meet up, or they group up at Oka okay, Okamira, Oka, which is a toy company, and of course this dude. For some reason, he reminds me of more of like the. Well, obviously he voiced the Joker, but it didn't really feel like the trickster. I you know. He was the original trickster, right? Yep. Yeah, yeah. Back in the uh, with uh, John Wesley Ship. Yeah. Yeah. I guess what the voice, I guess, is what gets me. So such a magnificent voice. Such a magnificent guy. Can't wait to see him in Star Wars. He's, he's a man of many faces. So they go over so they go over that plan and like I said, what do you call that doesn't want to go through with it? And they almost like threw down there for a second. Uh, Not interested, Barry. Yeah. This plan is giving me the chills. Not gonna do it. I'm giving them the cold shoulder. <laughs> So everybody finds out the three are loose and they try to find a way to stop him or stop Martin at least because he's the meta human there. And Barry tells them of the timeline where Cisco had already built the, the what is up with Barry and wands? Seriously. Yeah, he's another wizard. He's a wizard <laughs> Barry part two. I would have never thought that we'd have been able to tie Harry Potter into this, but we did. Hey man, so gotta stay frosty. <laughs> <laughs> So, yeah, he tells them of the time Cisco built the war, war oh, I said war, 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 and then Wells is like, why do you know all this stuff? And he's like, you probably shouldn't have changed the timeline. And then everyone's like, oh, it's already done. Let's just get this thing built. Things are happening. We need to stop the three. Back at Barry's lab. We need a name for his lab. I, I can't imagine. <laughs> no, I was trying to think of something. Okay. We'll think of a name one day. But back at the lab, Iris and Barry decide to tell Joe about his long lost son. And uh, How bad that he broke down, man. That was harsh. Uh -huh. so, well, it wasn't harsh. It was hard to watch. Daddy, I got to tell you something. I hope you're cool with it. Just just have a seat. Chill for a second. Oh, my God. He's... <laughs> <laughs> Damn it, Barry! <laughs> so she's like, yeah, you have, uh, Francine was pregnant before she left, and Joe was just like, okay, I need a minute, I need to go to work, I need to think about this, and then everybody was crying, and it was sad. Back at the house, Bear's already mentioned it. Snart said, I want, I don't want any part of this, I'm just gonna let you know that they're going to kill you, and then, okay, I have the perfect screenshot, maybe I'll put it in the video here, right, Jeremy? Like, yeah. right here? of him holding the deer mug, <laughs> drinking cocoa. That was amazing, I love that. <laughs> Mr. Jiggle Wiggle. Oh my gosh, yes. Yeah, Barry's just like, you know what, you're full of crap, man. Just get out of here. What is he full of crap on? The fact that he doesn't have any small marshmallows? Yes. <laughs> Barry goes and, well, I don't know why Joe was chilling there, but he was. 
Uh, <laughs> oh man, I did it, didn't I? Yeah, I didn't yes, you did. And that they have the a heart to heart. <laughs> oh, oh, we're all fired up now. <laughs> so yeah, they share a touching moment, and Joe's like, "I should have tried harder." And you know what? No, the decision. He, you guys think that he made the right decision then? I guess yeah. In that moment, to send Francine away. Yes. Yes. Well, and then not look for her. Well, she. Well, she was just. Addict. Yeah, she was very harmful and toxic to Iris's life. There's no way she knew he. Or he knew she could have been pregnant. It's just a circumstance, I guess. If the circumstances were a little different, maybe it would have been. Yeah, but that's, yeah. yeah. Back at the police department, we really get to see that guy, the, the chief or whatever, but, you chief. know, it's pretty cool. Patty is, like, still <laughs> looking up leads, and then the trickster shows himself on this TV screen, and that was that whole thing was just amazing. His, fa like, his facial expressions are, like, on point. He's a psycho. He is a psycho, dude. He's saying his own rendition of Rudolph, but I for know. Barry. I mean, yeah, he was like, he said uh, at, back at the toy thing, he was just like, deck the halls with the body parts of a girl named Holly yeah. or something like that. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, he's really sick. Crazy. So everybody's watching this feed and he's calling out the Flash and saying like, I, I want to kill you, basically. Yeah. And then Patty, of course, she's the one who heads to the scene first. And she's really good first off. Let's just, let's all give her a round of applause. So they're able to trace it and they go there, but it's it's a trap, obviously. Always tradle, something. tradle, tradle. They explode in your face. <laughs> yes. So they, they you know, they gotta get out of there because they're packed with C4, these tiny little dreidels, like Jeremy said. And what does Barry do? Did he fly out of there? Yes, he flew. He straight up flew out of there. He flew, he the pulled he pulled a reverse flash move right there. He turned into helicopter, Barry. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Dude, that was freaking epic, man. Yeah. Okay, so I got a screenshot, and this looks extremely inappropriate. But, Jer Jeremy, if you could put this on the screen somewhere. I can, um, I can. This is him flying. It looks like he's super humping Patty, but uh, <laughs> they're flying. And their phases are unfortunate, but... You know what? It, it was cool, I guess. You know what? And, Screw it. Uh, so <laughs> he saves them, and then he tries to talk her out of doing something real stupid. And then yeah. she's blaming. She, you know, she goes off into a whole uh, rant and saying like, she, it wasn't uh, the Martin brothers who killed her father. It was her because she was off goofing off with her friends, and she wasn't the one who was depositing the checks. It's it's like internal conflict, I guess. Everybody. She's basically going through what uh in a way i guess barry was going through like he he couldn't save the very person he went back to save because he knew changing something that's exactly what barry was going through yeah yep they're so much alike what is this official uh hashtag we got for this couple right here sperry sperry i thought perry <laughs> <laughs> she goes all crying and she leaves and then barry just doesn't again doesn't know what to do then back at the lab cisco builds the wand they suit up in the town uh like that the little gift giving thing or where you sit on santa's lap yeah uh yeah trickster is giving out presents and this this fricker man he's just you love the character, but you hate what he does. And they have bombs inside the little presents. Man, that kid made me realize how much times have changed. I, I want an iPhone. I want an iPod. I want all these electronics. I wanted a ball. I remember when I was a kid, like I wanted like a Spider-Man web shooter and stuff like that. Like all I toys. wanted were like action figures or Power Ranger swords, bionicles, bionicles. Oh, I said bionicles, man. bionicles. Bears, we bionicled the shit out of our. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, <sighs> oh my gosh, those were the days. Yu-Gi-Oh we cards, man. We weren't oh thinking about God. phones. We weren't thinking about technology. Yeah, back in our day. <laughs> we used to play with a ball and a string with the ball on the end of it. <laughs> we used to throw that thing for hours. It was so much fun. Scooters. Remember scooters, Grandpa? Oh, shoot. Ah, those things were the devil. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Scraped up my up. shoulder real bad with one of those. Oh dang! It was my fault. You can't hang, I thought Grandpa. I could do a 360. <laughs> Damn, Grandpa can't hang. I certainly could not. 
Oh, man. Uh, back at Star Labs, Zoom pops out of the breach and is like, I'm going to give you a little bit of time. And then the whole team, they just suit up and Barry goes to confront Martin, who's on top of... I don't even know, just like a really tall building overlooking the... Central the, City Square? Yeah, Christmas festivities. Yes. Yeah. Looking at this shot over here, like this shot over the city, it looks like the streets in uh, DCUO with the trees. Yeah, I think that's... That is weird. That's a cool little hint. Maybe that's yeah. what they're aiming for. So That'd it, be nice. That would be oh, nice. would be so sick if they made like a DLC for it. They, they got to, man. Yeah, they're bound to. Three. Okay, so Barry with his wand... Against the weather wizard. You're a wizard Barry. <laughs> you can do this. Harry's uh, counting expecto on you. Expecto Patronum! <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Barry versus Lord Weather over here. <laughs> <laughs> battle it out you can't be named <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and this dude just we saw barry fly this episode we saw this guy fly in almost the exact same fashion yeah uh barry with the speed and this guy just conjuring scientific terms i didn't get it but uh, he created an updraft which allowed him to float on air basically exactly. by heating the air creating an updraft then we have this pretty cool so he's actually gotten a lot more op since we last seen him um, yes so he's flying around barry's trying to keep keep up with him and it was pretty sick the still shots uh, were very cool. He was there was a slow mo on a helicopter. That was pretty sick. Yeah, I actually. And like I one. got every second of that. Nice. <laughs> Barry obviously speedster can't really beat the dude. Aims his wand right at Lord Weather and uh, shoots him out of the sky. But then he gives an ultimatum. What is what? What does he tell him? Let me hit you, Barry. Or I blow up all the children's. These people are sick, man. Oh well, yeah, one of them was crazy, and the other one. It's crazy. <laughs> so he lets uh, Weather Wizard wail on him, and then the team, seeing that he's dying, or he, he's gonna die, they have to make up a plan real quick, which is, Jeremy, what, what do they do? Oh, they use the I drone awesome. to use magnetic powers to send all the bombs through the breach. Wells oh. is a genius. He says to Cisco, you like that drone? Well... You're not gonna get it back. Say bye bye. <laughs> okay, that was that had to be easily like one of my favorite lines on the show was when Wells shows up to the kids' door and is just like, <laughs> "Give me all your toys." <laughs> Basically, all they needed was one box. One box creates this whole magnetic thing, and they would just suck up all the other stuff into yeah. it. And uh, I thought that was pretty fancy. Barry's still getting his ass kicked out onto the streets. They're able to do it. And uh, Barry is able to neutralize the two. And then who quite shows easily. up? Yeah, quite easily. And then who shows up? Uh, Martian Manhunter. <laughs> Martian yes. Manhunter. Patty, yes. Patty shows up. Yes. Yeah. Patty's Martian Manhunter. Illuminati <laughs> confirmed. How you like them magnets, bitch? <laughs> that's, that's what, How do they work? <laughs> he's just like, you don't want to do this. Okay, you don't want to kill. This is not what your dad would wanted. Yeah, she shoots... The flash on his leg. Yeah, with like a restraining device. That's I know, uh... she's she's crazy. I don't know where the hell she got that. I used to be a speedster like you, and I took a restraining device to the knee. <laughs> <laughs> Ultimately, he's able to convince her not to do the bad deed. Yeah. And uh, Mark Campbell is just like, that was beautiful. <laughs> no, he is mad crazy. So Barry's healing up, and Joe sees him at the lab. At Star Labs, and he's just like, man, that that uh, the feels, man. Yeah. For some reason, Joe's best dad. That reminded, dude. It, it's just, yeah, it just hits close to home. That that mm. scene right there. He's just like, here's this watch. I I said I was gonna give this to my son, and I am. He said that he talked to Francine, right? Yeah. So he then, said he he talked to Francine, but did not meet Wally yet. Yeah. Then we have right after that heart tugging moment, we have like another one. And I Barry... think there's like three heart tugging moments in a row. <laughs> yeah. Be ready to like kind of cry if you're a dude watching the show. We got that. Then we have Barry. Or using Wells from Earth 2 as a stand in for yes. Wells from this time. Was it? Do you think he was he was talking to Wells or Eobard? Well, it's essentially Eobard, but Wells okay, from so, Earth 1. Yeah. And he says, I forgive you. Uh, Wells turns around and is just like, Do you need me or something? And yeah. he's like, no, why don't you come out and hang out with us for Christmas? And Wells is just like, I feel really bad for this Earth 2 Wells. Mm -hmm. We go back to the West household, West Allen household, and everybody's having a merry time. We even get the smooch of finally. Yes. About time. Damn right. Caitlin and uh and Jay, what are what are they called? 
What's 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 a mistletoe? Jalen? Jalen, yeah, I actually like that. Then Patty shows up and then they have their smooch. Yep. Cisco is all alone. Yeah. And so is Iris. Oh, they then go. knock knock. Dun 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 I am your son. <laughs> <laughs> I am your brother son? <laughs> I don't know why, but watching that part felt like the ending of a Lifetime movie. <laughs> the way he presented himself, like, it made me real, really feel for him. Because he's like, you could already tell that he's going to be a really good kid. So And before he's a little piece of, yeah. He's just like, you know, I'll come back at a later time. You got people around. And Joe's like, no, no, no. Cut, come inside because Joe's the freaking man. What uh, a boss. Yeah, you could just see it in his face. Like, he's like, this is my son. That's my boy. boy. We can only, I guess, uh, hope that he's going to be turn out to, to be a good person. Uh, Wells decides to spend his Christmas with Zoom. <laughs> and the whole plan for Zoom was to make, he said, you're fattening him up. Yeah. So that he's he like, could you're fattening up like a Christmas goose. <laughs> Well, yes. Yeah. And Zoom's just like, you know what? You want to see your daughter right now? He shows him his daughter. And then takes her back right before Wells can uh, do anything. That was that was sad. So at least she's alive. But you know, Zoom has her, and I think that's where it leaves us, right? Yeah. He he. Did you say that he gives him an ultimatum? You either uh, steal Flash's speed, or your daughter she die. Yeah. Oh, her soul is mine. So so he basically January... sorry he basically became Earth One Wells again, but for yeah, a different but... reason. Yeah, exactly. Man, that sucks. Every he, single he person gets doesn't really in. want to take the speed, but it's for Zoom, and that's basically <sighs> what the other Zoom—I mean, the other uh, Reverse Flash did. Yeah. They wanted to do. Come January nineteenth, we have a bit of a break. Perry is in trouble. In big, big trouble. Yeah, it's gotten worse. Basically, Barry's about to tell her his secret. For some reason, this looks like Dan's news from the creatures who's holding her hostage. <laughs> Um, and it, this does not look good right now. She, she's in trouble. She's, I, I'm pretty sure there's a scene right there where Zoom, like, popped in. Yeah, so, Easter eggs, if you guys found any. I saw a bunch of Flash things, like the toy yeah. and, uh, the thing on the tree. The yeah, ornament. the ornament. How the freak she um, get a Flash horn? Oh, well, you got a toy, so you got to have Yeah, yeah. Flash pictures? Do you think you're... Flash makes any money off of that? Like, I mean, <laughs> I they so. are using his a... image. I think it's a city. <laughs> Maybe just a city, yeah. So, uh... They're banking off of him. It's messed up. Bear's like, where's my royalties, man? Yeah. What the hell? Right? That's my face. <laughs> yeah. So who do we make this check payable to? The Flash. Hello. So, How does he check it? Does he, like, wait in line at the bank like everybody else? He could just steal the money and just leave his check there. No. <laughs> that defeats the purpose of being a hero. <laughs> I'm not really stealing that, I guess, if he leaves his check there. It's just like... Yes, it's you're taking money without permission. Well, they're taking money from him without permission. Are they? Yes. When? The toys. The coffee. But if he gets a cut of it... But he's paying for his own coffee. Yeah, he flashes nifty cards, like, put it on my tab. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, the, I guess the Akamoro thing, we, we'll put that in there. I, I'm not really sure the whole relevance to that, but I'll... I'll Mr. Jiggle Wiggle. Mr. Jiggle Wiggle. Jiggle Wiggle. Jiggle Wiggle Wiggle. <laughs> Jiggle, jiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Diggle, 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 diggle. Yeah, Diggle comes driving in. I got me a jiggle, wiggle, wiggle. <laughs> <laughs> and then the song. Boo, 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 boo. Oh no, it's his new getup. His Christmas getup. He's just as jiggle, wiggle. <laughs> it's jiggle, wiggle, diggle. <laughs> <laughs> jiggle, wiggle, diggle. That's amazing. Uh, oh. Hashtag jiggle, wiggle, diggle. Oh, killing it with these hashtags. <laughs> So, what's the common theories? Obviously, Patty is in trouble. Zoom is still out there. Wally West, is he going to become the next Flash or his own Flash? Yes. Yeah, so, he, so could just be, he could take over uh, Daniel West's story. Hopefully not. Well, maybe you could see him being somebody else. I being guess. something else. <laughs> oh my gosh. We always need a quota. Barry and West are going to be like best friends there. Dude. Be like, man, Barry, I don't know how you run so fast. You look good about doing it, bro. Oh, no. I can't quit you, Barry! <laughs> <laughs> we filled the quota for the day. We needed that. Can't go through. We sure did. We can't complete one of these until that's been thrown in there. Beautiful. 10 out of 10. Fantastic. Man. Patty's going to know the secret. She's going to know Barry's secret. I don't want her to die. 
It she ain't looks gonna die. like she, she ain't gonna die. Oh yeah, she'll find out the secret and then bam, that's it. She's dead. And then he has to run back in time. Again. Nah, she stayed dead. Oh. Again. Space I'll be like, okay, I can fire my versus and I'm walk back in time. What are you doing? Just let me run. And where's Wells is gonna be like, no Barry, we cannot change the timeline. Can't let you do that, Barry. It's gonna make me sad. This is the first Christmas Everybody's together. Dead. And they're last. Yeah. <sighs> It's like some tagline for some horrible movie. It was their first Christmas together, and it was also their last. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, we have to wait till the 19th. Yeah, ratings. What do you guys rate this? One white and wonderful Wally West reveal of a Christmas. Yes. <laughs> a widowation. I'm gonna give this one a nice cup of hot cocoa with small marshmallows on a cold day. Nice. nice. Uh, I give this a hashtag jiggle wiggle diggle. <laughs> <laughs> and hashtag Perry forever, but it doesn't look like that's gonna. Perry 2015. <laughs> Perry 2015 to 2015. Dang. Uh, no, no, 2015 to 2016. You I'm said sorry. it. <laughs> so, that being said, you guys, uh, we do have a bit of a break, like I said. I don't fun know. Run, man. Part in like eight, no, nine weeks. I know. We uh, high five team. Uh, we, we've been pretty. Actually, all three of us have uh, done this straight through on yeah, this show. Flash, yes. And uh, yes. it's a shield too. Yeah. Um, actually, all of them. Oh, that's crazy. With the exception of Supergirl, but yeah, su Supergirl. That's, that's an exception. Details, details. <laughs> so. Yeah, we'll see you guys, I guess, in whatever video we decide to post up until the reviews start back up. Thank you guys for supporting us. Please be sure to leave a like and comment down below. Pop on over to my channel, where Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. happens. We do that over there. And uh, check out the movie pilot posts. All right. And don't forget to hashtag Jiggle Wiggle Diggle. But other than that, thank you guys for watching. And yeah, we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Bye. Jiggle Wiggle Diggle.